Properties of acids and bases. Acids are going to taste sour. A lot of our fruit has citric acid in it. Uh, if you have sour candy, if you look at the ingredients, you're going to see acids in those. While bases are going to taste bitter. So bitter bases. Your cleaning products are going to be bases. Soap, dark chocolate, all basic. Acids are corrosive. If you recall, that means they dissolve in metals. Bases feel slippery. Again, think soap. Acids turn blue litmus paper red. There's lots of different indicators to tell if something's an acid or a base. Litmus paper is just one of them. Litmus paper turns blue in the presence of a base. So red for acids, blue for base. So blue, bitter base. The pH of acids is less than seven. So anything less than seven is gonna be an acid. Greater than seven is a base. And right at seven is neutral. Acids are electrolytes. If you recall from previous chapters, we said electrolytes conduct electricity because they break up into ions. So acids break up into ions, so they conduct electricity, as do bases. And finally, acids produce hydrogen ions, and that's why it's an electrolyte, because it's producing hydrogen ions, while bases are electrolytes because they're producing hydroxide ions. So if you know your concentrations of hydrogen and hydroxide, then you can figure out if it's an acid or a base or neutral. Remember that on the previous side, slide we said that acids give off hydrogen ions. So you can think our hydrogen ions came from an acid and hydroxide came from a base. If we have more acid or hydrogen ions than hydroxide, then it's gonna be acidic. If I have more hydroxide than hydrogen, then I'm going to have a base. And if I have equal amounts of hydrogen and hydroxide, they're going to neutralize, and then we're going to get a neutral solution. Finally, your pH scale, you need to know that anything from 0 to 7 is an acid, right at 7 is neutral, and anything greater than 7 is a base. So go ahead and label your pH scale acid, base, and neutral. The stronger the acid, the lower the pH value, and the more hydrogen ions you have in solution. The stronger the base, the higher the pH value, and the more hydroxide ions you have in solution. So if you have a pH of 9 and a pH of 11, which one is the stronger base? If you said pH 11 is the stronger base, you are correct because the higher the pH, the stronger the base. If you have a pH of five and a pH of one, which one's the stronger acid? If you said pH of one, then again, you are correct. The lower the pH value, the stronger the acid. And if you have a pH of 6.5, what is it? An acid, a base, or is it neutral? If you said an acid, you are correct, because anything less than seven is an acid. 